I'm JC from Craft Life and I'm here today to teach you how to make these decorative jars and these are great for Halloween but you can even make them for any time of the year. They are super fun and easy to make and the supplies you'll need to make these are a mason jar or any jar. You can even recycle a spaghetti sauce jar. You will also need tights or trouser socks with designs. And as you can see here, this one has a design in it. And I will be using trouser socks today. You will also need a roller, scissors, tea lights. You will also need ribbon, and you can use decorative ribbon for this. A glue gun. And if you want to add anything onto the front of it, you can use a spider for Halloween. Any rhinestones or decorations like buttons you can add on as well. So please get your supplies and we'll begin. To begin, you're going to remove the lid from your jar and turn it over. If you are using a trouser sock like me, you are going to need to cut off this top part here. Mine is elastic and you will not need to do this if you are using tights. Now you're going to take your scissors and cut straight across. Now you're going to use your trouser sock, open it up, and use your fingers to scrunch it all the way to the bottom. Once you get to the bottom, you're going to take your jar, stretch it out, and use some of your fingers to hold it in place, and place your sock onto it. Now we're going to turn it over and pull the rest of the sock out. Make sure you like how it looks on the jar and if you do not like it, you can pull it and stretch it out or make it tighter. Once you have it the way you like it, you're just going to hold the top part, do not stretch it out. Take your scissors and cut straight across the top. Now we're going to take it, push it all down, and then fix it around the edges. I'm going around and folding under all of the edges. Now we are going to add on our decorations to our jar. I just cut my ribbon to nine and a half inches, and you may need to make yours longer or shorter. I just wrap my ribbon around and just have it overlap a little bit. Now you're going to place a dot of glue. Now I'm just going to place dots of glue all the way around so that it stays in place. Now I'm going to place my final dot of glue on the other end of my ribbon. Now you can add on anything you want to your jar. You can add on a spider or a rhinestone, but I really want to place a spider on mine. Now I'm going to glue my spider down, so I'm going to place glue and place my spider down. Once your glue is dry, you are going to place your tea light inside of your jar, and then you will be finished. This is what they look like when they're done. And here's what they look like in the dark. As you can see, these were very easy to make and they make great room decor and gifts. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you make some, I'd love to see them. My Instagram is CraftLifeUSA, so please tag me in a photo. Please don't forget to like us on Facebook, pin it on Pinterest, and subscribe right here on YouTube. I hope you're living a craft life just like me. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!